There was no warning the night that phone appeared in my apartment. One moment, nothing. The next, the screen glowed in the shadows. Curiosity got the better of me. It seemed like just another smartphone, but then it showed me something. A grainy video of an alley downtown. A violent, hidden camera-style clip. I dismissed it as a twisted joke. But the next night, it happened again. Different place. An old warehouse, but the same raw, brutal violence. The next day, news reports confirmed the horrors I'd seen. The phone wasn't just showing random violence, it was predicting it. I tried to get rid of it, but it found its way back to me, each time with new, more gruesome footage. It wasn't just a device, it felt like a predator, stalking me with these nightmarish glimpses. That was just the beginning. I didn't realize it then, but this phone was more than a mere window to terror. It was part of something darker, something that was slowly pulling me into its 